This gallery is more for Russian contemporary art lovers or people who are really curious. So they would love to explore. They may not know anything about Russian contemporary art. They may know a lot and they would love to see one of the best artists, which are usually showcased here. Well, to me, Russian contemporary art is quite specific because, of course, a lot of artists are being influenced by how life was in the Soviet Union. Natalia Nesterov, whose exhibition we can see on the back and everywhere around, she is considered probably one of the most well-known Russian contemporary artists of nowadays. A lot of her artworks were influenced by the music she would listen to or um, the books she would read. And once she was able to travel, it was a complete change. For her and she has a series of artworks where there are people on the balconies and they are just white silhouettes with eyes on them so for her it started when she was able to travel and see the world she was all eyes she felt like she is a one big eye or like millions of eyes everywhere because she wanted to see and absorb and that's when the style of her painting started to change She's been influenced by a lot of Jewish musicians and Jewish artists and um, composers and writers. Um, that is why she really wanted to show um, people being actually really talented, even though during the Soviet times it was really hard to be Jewish because of the repressions and people not understanding Jewish culture. Sometimes you don't see any emotion on the faces of the people on her works because she does not try to connect with the face she tries to connect with the movement with the motion with the color so sometimes if it's not serious with the eyes where it's just a white silhouette um, people on her artworks they wear masks so it's just the mask it can be anybody it can be any kind of person but this person just tells the story with what they do on the artwork and one of the artworks is masks. It's two people just sitting playing cards and they're wearing masks. It's something so casual to me, as I understand this artwork, is just, it can be anybody, they can be talking about anything. So a person who looks at the artwork, they can see themselves doing that. For example, at Natalia's opening, a lot of people just came to talk to her and to tell her that they are really grateful to have her works and her in their collection or um, see her new works or just meet her.